Hello there and welcome to Pets Aplenty. Today on the channel, you'll be learning about the Boxer Dog Breed, a respectable and self-assured guard dog and companion. We've gathered all this information to help you make an informed decision in your adoption process. But before we continue though, we would love for you to subscribe to our channel and turn on post notifications. Become a member of the channel by clicking on the join button down below. You can also review the perks of Pets Aplenty membership after clicking the join button. Now, let's get into the video. Dog Breed History what we all popularly call a boxer may be traced back to Germany in the late 1800s and early 1900s. Today, boxers have become one of America's top 10 most popular breeds since that time. At that time, the breed was supposed to have been bred down by German dog fanciers from the Bullenbeiser, a giant, heavier German breed. The political situation in the German states were shifting by the early 1800s. German nobility was unpopular. There was states were divided and the long-held ritual of lavishly outfitted boar hunts was discontinued. The Bullenbeiser was Germany's top big game hunter in medieval times, utilized by noblemen to pursue down, capture, and keep such dangerous opponents as bears, bison, and wild boar on massive estates. The great Bullenbeiser was out of work by 1865. The outmoded big game hunter was given new life by strategic crosses to a smaller, mastiff-type breed from England. By the late 1800s, the contemporary boxer, a sleeker, more attractive dog, had emerged. Boxers have served as athletes, livestock dogs, police dogs, military dogs in both world wars, watchdogs, protection dogs, and guide dogs for the blind. The AKC first registered a boxer in 1904. Still, the breed's heyday in the United States started in the 1950s when a Westminster winning boxer called Bang Away became a national superstar. Appearance Boxers have regal, square heads that are distinctively formed. Their snout is blunt and their mouth is undershot. The coat is either fawn or brindle with white markings. Their face or mask is usually black, but many of them have white facial markings and white on their chest and paws. Underneath the short, tight-fitting coat, their muscles ripple. They have a large, deep chest and a short, powerful back. Males are about 22 and a half to 25 inches tall at the shoulder and weigh around 70 pounds. Females usually stand 21 to 23 and a half inches tall and weigh about 60 pounds. Boxer ears naturally fold over, but they have historically been clipped to stand straight. Their tails are often docked and held high. Their feet are tiny with arched toes. The dark brown eyes and furrowed brow give the face an alert, inquisitive expression. They take their roles as watchdogs and family protectors seriously and will face dangers front on. Temperament Boxers are bright, high-energy, lively dogs that prefer to keep themselves active. Despite their gruff appearance, boxers are surprisingly lovely companions. The boxer is a hearing guard dog, which means it is alert and observant. Boxers have all the temperamental features you will desire in a dog. He is loyal, bright, loving, intellectual, alert, hardworking, and has beautiful looks. They like to be with their owners and are devoted pets that will aggressively protect their family and property from intruders. Strangers are treated with suspicion, whereas friendly individuals are received cordially. They are only violent when defending their family and home and seldom bark excessively. However, boxers are vocal, and the dog growling noise is the dog's communication method. At all ages, they are generally playful. Puppies with good temperaments are interested in lively, eager to approach and be held by humans. To make a good selection, during adoption, try meeting the dog's parents, siblings, or other blood relatives. It's always beneficial in determining what a puppy will be like as an adult, but it's not a certainty. Socialization 
Socialization as a practice helps to guarantee that your boxer puppy will develop into and remain a well-rounded, outgoing, sociable dog. Enrolling them at puppy kindergarten is a terrific place to start. Inviting guests regularly, bringing them to crowded parks, shops that accept dogs, and on leisurely strolls to meet neighbors can help them improve their social skills. When it comes to socialization, a boxer puppy may not be the first one off the bench, but they get along well with other species members. Boxers are great for people who want a canine friend with them most of the time and for more prominent active families with houses often inhabited by someone. They may thrive on a rural estate or in a metropolitan apartment as long as they can run about and burn off energy. Regular walks and other forms of exercise are essential if you live in a city. Still, while you're at it, you must consider that boxers are heat sensitive and should be kept cool. In addition, they also need cold protection protection due to their short coats. Boxers may see cats as a meal rather than a partner due to their innate hunting instinct. However, if you expose them to kittens early and often, you should have no problems. Grooming the short, lustrous coat of the boxer requires just an occasional wash. Their tiny noses and short coats makes them unsuitable for staying an outdoor pet. They will love playing in a fenced yard. However, boxers are domesticated dogs. Once or twice a week, a thorough once-over with a rubber curry brush or hound glove should keep them looking their best. Schedule dental cleanings, ear cleanings, and semi-annual pedicures with a professional if you can. His nails should be clipped at least least once a month unless they're naturally worn down on a hard surface. Aside from his professional dental appointments, his teeth should be cleaned frequently, daily if possible, to avoid tartar formation. Exercise Boxers are high energy lively canines who require a minimum of two hours of workout daily. Mind training is excellent for boxers as a powerful intellect sits behind that strong, square jaw and oversized crania. Consider giving your dog an intellectually challenging assignment, such as a job or a puzzle toy. Because of the breed's history as a wild game hunter, they spend a lot of time hopping and leaping around like young pups. They constantly need reminders from you to educate them to remember main calm. Because the boxer is a robust, lively, and playful dog, he may not be the most excellent option for an elderly person or a little kid. However, if you are not in shape now, you will be once your boxer puts his paws on you. Boxers are pretty bright, yet they may grow bored with repetition. Boxers thrive in various canine sports, including obedience, agility, and herding. They excel as service, assistance, therapy dogs, as well as narcotics narcotics detection, and search and rescue duties. No matter what it takes, the boxer should never be left alone as the breed easily gets overwhelmed. Training the temperament of the boxer influences their trainability. To get them to take training seriously, it's necessary for you to start early and use firm, proper training techniques, as well as positive incentives in the form of praise, play, and treats. Consistency and patience are essential while house training your boxer. Early socialization and puppy training lessons are critical in directing the breed's energy and excitement in a constructive direction. When you let your boxer get away with anything, he'll push to see what else he can get away with. Before you go for training, take them on an enthusiastic walk or play session to calm them down. They'll be able to concentrate better that way. Take your boxer out to pee regularly and praise them when they perform their business outside. Crate training is advised. Some puppies are house trained by four months, while others aren't until they're seven months to a year old. They're joyful and exuberant, bouncy, and a little mischievous. It takes a little effort and an early start to make a well rounded dog. Diet and Nutrition a boxer is a medium-sized breed with a lot of energy. This should be considered when his diet is being designed. The nutritional demands of your boxer will keep changing from puppyhood through maturity. As with all dogs, they'll continue to change into their senior years. You should consult your veterinarian regarding your boxer's diet since there is so much variance between individual dogs, including weight, energy, and health, to offer a particular prescription. The boxer should thrive on high-quality dog food 
reviewed, whether commercially or homemade, with your veterinarian supervision and consent. Discover which human foods are okay for dogs and which are not. A bowl of clean, fresh water should be provided daily. Boxers may gain weight if overfed, so keep a regular feeding plan. Two meals each day are usually suggested. Some dogs are prone to becoming overweight, so keep an eye on your dog's calorie intake and weight level. Treats may be a valuable training tool, but feeding too much can lead to obesity. Health Boxers are typically healthy, although every potential owner should remember that the breed is prone to specific health issues. Responsible breeders examine their stock for hip dysplasia, heart disorders such as aortic stenosis and cardiomyopathy, degenerative myelopathy, thyroid insufficiency, and certain malignancies. However, not all boxers will get any or all of these ailments. The National Breed Club recommends the following health tests from time to time if you own a boxer. Evaluation of the elbow, DNA test for degenerative myelopathy, hip examination, ASSAS, cardiovascular aortic valve disease, thyroid examination, and cardiomyopathy. The boxer cannot tolerate excessive heat or cold. As such, he should always be kept indoors. You may also want to look out for epilepsy because while seizures are uncommon in boxers, they may occur. Certain kinds of cancer are more common in this breed. Lastly, boxers may also also have eye, heart, and skin issues, particularly around the skin folds on their faces. However, don't worry too much about your pet's health. Responsible pet owners check for severe disorders ahead of time. Your boxer may live a long, healthy life with regular vet visits and essential maintenance. However, you should contact a veterinarian if you have any health concerns. We hope this video on the Boxer Dog Breed was helpful and informative. Let us know in the comments section. Remember to subscribe to our channel and turn on post notifications so you'll be the first to know when we post a new pet video. Consider becoming a member of the channel by clicking the join button to get early access to our upcoming videos plus other membership perks. Also, check out our playlists and click on the video links that pop up at the end of this video. Thank you for watching.